please ask your heart what is freedom of expression and where you should not trespass and transgress now if any stray incident happened if anyone uh, 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 shouted any slogans outside the spirit of the common minimum of the rally the organizers of the rally cannot take responsibility for those slogans our slogans were not anti india uh, maybe it was anti state but it was uh, not anti india they are unrepentant and unapologetic hours after they stoked off a massive controversy by raising slogans in favor of afzal guru from the campus premises of jadhav university this fringe group radical has now put up posters as such across jadhav university campus posters with bold words and no uncertain terms literally condemning the hanging of afzal guru and yakub menon these posters are also demanding freedom for kashmir manipur and nagaland these posters which have now been put up uh, across the jadhav university premises uh, have not really found too much of support uh, that was unfortunate that the anti national sentiment we don't support that anyone in the country anyone in the country support anti nationalism and action must be taken against them anyone in the country as counter protest break out on campus students have made their point waiting for a state government to act jo tmc hai kyunki unko vote bank ki rajneeti karni hai aur abhi chunav 2 mahine dur hai isliye us pe action nahi legi meanwhile at delhi's jnu the search is on for umar khalid the dsu student leader seen in this video He was on the news hour last Friday before police revealed an ultra left troll. None of us gave that slogan, but there were some people from Kashmir who did give that slogan. If today those slogans are be given in Kashmir, the point is that was given in the. You are saying you are saying that it was unintentional. The Jammu Kashmir. You are saying it was unintentional. That is because no, you are saying it was unintentional, and you expect me to believe you when I have your poster in my hand. The search for Umar Khalid is on in four states, but on the JNU campus, we tried to speak to those in the know, those who back what unfolded. While some elements here in this campus are propagating radical views in the name of freedom of expression, we learn that several posters showing anti-India sentiments still adorn the walls of the campus here. Tomorrow you will What say ISIS is not a terrorist organization. Let the ISIS terrorists come here. Let them debate with us. You will say Al Qaeda is not a terrorist organization. Let the Al Qaeda guys come here. I mean, are you going to allow your campuses being flooded by such terrorist groups and fringe elements and separatists? Not at all. but if they want to discuss with us on ideological positions we will discuss with them as we try to speak to more and more people on campus we were stopped who are these students belonging to which group they belong to all political parties hmm. they are the people belonging to isa to ssi to democratic students federation to uh, dsu to student islamic organization to students league every organization are here from jnu to jadavpur left or right and irrespective of the narrative being offered the heart of the issue is the anti india campaign and the need to fight it the need for one india one voice and zero tolerance to treason with tamal in kolkata and prema shridevi in new delhi niranjan for times now